How's it going everybody? Welcome to another tutorial on my channel. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to show what Nintendo Switch game you're playing on Discord as a custom status. So, without the way, let's get started. First, we're going to want to go into the link in the description. And we'll be downloading this program called Nintendo Switch Discord Status by Hobbygrade. So, depending on your operating system, we're going to choose the version of the program that corresponds with it. So, in my case, I'm on Windows 11. We're just going to click on the .exe file. Now, it'll probably give you an error that says that it's a virus, but it's not. It's 100% safe. Won't do anything malicious to your computer. It just changes the screwed up a bit to show cousin status. And I accidentally hit my mic. Not sure if it was noticeable or not. But. Now we're just going to go to the free dots here. Keep in mind that this part depends on your web browser. I'm on Windows 11's Microsoft Edge. So we're just going to click on the free dots here. Click on keep. Show more. Keep anyway. Then wait for it to download. Now you want to click on open file. Go to minimize. Now the download should take no more than 30 seconds. If it takes longer then just be patient. It probably did, has to do with the computer you're using. But once that's done, we're going to wait a little bit for the program to open. Now this part will only take probably like 10 seconds at most. Okay, so it took a little longer than I expected, but it still shouldn't take that long. Even if it is a little over 10 seconds. But once we're here, we're now going to go to the game tab. We're going to choose the name of the game we want. So in my case, on my Nintendo Switch, I have Cuphead running. So I'm just going to type in Cuphead. Now we're just going to click on Cuphead here. And now on the status, you could put this as anything you want, but I'm just going to do playing cup head. And now we're just going to want to click on submit. And then if we open Discord, I'll say playing Nintendo Switch. I'm going to click on it. And as you can see, it'll show the name of the game we're playing and the status we put. So as if we go back here, i will say that there's a button here called idle. If we click on it. I'll just say that you're on your home page. So yeah, that's pretty much it. The only downside to this program I found is that you have to change the game manually if you want to go to a different game. Like if I close out Cuphead on my Switch and I go into like Mario Odyssey, I'll have to go here and type in Super Mario Odyssey or Super Mario whatever till we get to where we can find Super Mario Odyssey. And then, yeah, and have to change the status to su playing Super Mario Odyssey or whatever you want that's related to Mario Odyssey if you wish. So, I'm just going to do playing Mario here. But, and then we're just going to click on submit. And, yeah, it'll change. It's the only downside to this program I found, but, yeah, this is a nice alternative to having Discord on the Switch. Because I don't know if they'll ever put Discord on the Switch. I hope they do one day. But if they don't, this is a nice alternative to show what games you're playing. Uh, so who knows? Maybe there's a homebrew app that lets you do this. But if there is, this is a nice alternative. Where if you don't have a modified Nintendo Switch. Now to get rid of the status, just going to click on the close button. And then it'll take a minute to show, or not show, get rid of the status. But it's gone. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.